Good thing is we don't have temperatures that'll be near zero for a while. We're going to stay fairly mild as we go through the week, but we will be cooling down as we head toward the end of the week. Take a look at the temperatures right now. 25 feeling into the 30s. We're going to do it all over again as we head through the day tomorrow. It's even warmer toward Muskoka uh, with temperatures up to about 27 degrees. So uh, mild conditions hanging on. Moisture from Florence staying to our south. Looks like we missed out on it. Even the Niagara region missing, missing out on it. The cold front that'll be moving through that'll change things a little bit for us during the day on Wednesday is into northern Ontario. All we're really going to see out of it is some cloud cover. Then we'll get into that little bit of a cool down and then temperatures will bounce right back up with another system on Thursday before that colder air behind that next one settles in and sticks around for a little bit. So another day tomorrow with temperatures well above the average mark. We do have that cooler weather on the way for the beginning of autumn, which is on Saturday. 19 sunny start to the day tomorrow looks like it is going to be a nice day to grab lunch outside and take a long walk if you can on your lunch break just get outside and enjoy it because things are changing and you'll see it in the seven day forecast with some of the cooler air that is going to be moving through so mid 20s during midday tomorrow. 26 will be the daytime high, Hemodex near 32. We'll still see some sunshine with just a couple of clouds lingering on. When you look at the seven day forecast, a couple of things to pay attention to uh, as we head into the uh, end of the week and into the weekend is going to be that cooler air. Um, one thing I will mention is those 18s over the weekend, uh, they may arrive on Saturday. It's all about timing here with that front that swings through the area. So it uh, looks like the cooler air does get here once we get toward the weekend. We'll keep an eye on the showers so Thursday, and then with the back end of that, we could see some lingering thunderstorms coming our way on Friday. I'm going to take a look at the forecast again in a little greater detail for you uh, coming up on City News tonight at 11 o'clock. So we'll see you then.